Continental Airlines welcomes you to Belfast. Over the next few minutes, we'd like to familiarize you with the Belfast International Airport and acquaint you with the beauty of this legendary city. All customers must complete a landing card prior to arrival. Fill in the form using blue or black ink. If you have any questions, please ask a flight attendant for assistance. After deplaning, follow the signs down the hall to passport control. Enter the appropriate queue and present your documents to the inspector. Once you've cleared passport control, proceed to the baggage carousel and claim your items. Then follow the signs to the customs area and enter the appropriate lane. Use the green lane if you have nothing to declare. Please be advised that bringing meat and dairy products into the European Union is generally prohibited. Restrictions also apply to many other food items and plants. If you have questions about this restriction, please contact a customs official upon arrival. Failure to declare food, dairy, and plant items may result in delays, fines, or prosecution by the customs authority. The main arrivals area includes all of the customary services, including ATMs, money exchange, tourist information, and car rental counters. Ground transportation can be found just outside the terminal. An airport taxi stand is available to answer questions about fares and to direct you to the appropriate queue. Buses run between the airport and Belfast City Center approximately every 30 minutes. A uniformed Continental Airlines representative will be meeting the flight to answer any questions you may have. Ireland's first settlers landed near modern-day Belfast over 9,000 years ago, creating a city rich with history and culture. With a concentrated city center that winds around the River Lagan, Belfast is ideal for getting around on foot. City Hall is a perfect jumping-off point for starting your tour of Belfast. After taking a free guided tour of the Renaissance-style building, head north and you will shortly find yourself in the shopping district. If people watching and pub crawling is more your taste, simply head northeast instead. For the museum, beautiful botanic gardens and entertainment district, head south down Dublin Road. One of Belfast's great Victorian landmarks is the Grand Opera House, which first opened its doors in 1859. No trip to Belfast would be complete without a trip to one of Belfast's famous bars. The National Trust's Crown Liquor Saloon was built in the late 19th century and exemplifies decorative Victorian flamboyance. Plenty of pubs, sites, and walking make Belfast an ideal place to spend a week or a weekend. On behalf of all of us at Continental Airlines, we hope you enjoy your stay.